Hi students, uh, in this video we will discuss a few multiple choice questions, neat level questions from the chapter Plant Kingdom. See the first question. Green algae usually have rigid cell wall made of. The chief uh, chemical component of the cell wall in all the classes of algae is cellulose which forms the inner layer. So remember cellulose forms the inner layer. The outer layer uh, various other chemicals would be there. In case of green algae, it is pectose. So, inner layer cellulose, outer layer pectose. Whereas in brown algae, outer layer algae. Multicellular female gametophyte of gymnosperm bears. One archegonia, two archegonia, two or more archegonia, the different options given. Specifically, the point is given in NCRT that one of the megaspores Develops to form a female gametophyte which bears two or more archegonia. Archegonia is the sex organ in gymnosperms. Arrange this in the correct sequence of the origin. Here, uh, in bryophytes, gametophyte dominance and sporophyte dependence. Whereas in pteridophytes, Pteridophytes, sporophyte dominance, At the same time gametophyte independence. Then in gymnosperm and angiosperms, sporophyte dominance and gametophyte dependence. So that is the correct sequence of the origin of the traits. Then next question Within a gymnosperm megasporangium, what is the correct sequence? in which the following should appear during the development, assuming that fertilization occurs. Here you see, it starts with the megaspore. Megaspore develops to form female gametophyte. Female gametophyte will produce the female gamete, that is egg. And after fertilization, it forms zygote, which will develop to form a sporophytic embryo. Zygote will develop to form a sporophytic embryo. This is the correct sequence of the development. Next question, cyanobacteria are placed under, right answer is cyanobacteria are placed under kingdom Monera. Even though, uh, because of its resemblance, similarities, it was placed in kingdom Plantae. It was called as blue-green algae because of its photosynthetic ability. Later, it was placed in kingdom Monera because it is a prokaryote. Hold fast. Stripe and frond constitutes the plant body in case of. Actually, this is an NCRT exemplar question. The right answer is Phyophysia, brown algae. If the diploid number of a following plant is 36, what would be the number of chromosome in its endosperm? So, here the given data is 2 and is 36. What would be a triploid number? 2 and 36 means an. 18. So, which among the following is called as relic of past? The right answer here is uh, Cycus. It's called as relic of the past because of its resemblance to the previous groups or because of its primitive uh, characters like leaf, like megasporophyll, uh, motile or flagellated. Uh, male gametes, presence of archegonia, etc. So, because of its uh, primitive characters, it is known as a relic of the past. This is a uh, NCRT exemplar question. If you have not yet subscribed, please subscribe my channel. And if you have any doubt regarding this topic, uh, please comment below. Thanks for watching.